Hey YouTube, I'm just wondering what is going on with YouTube comments. Um, you see on the screen here that I did an update on the latest video that I did on uh, Jonathan Cleck entitled Jonathan Cleck Prophet or False Teacher. And um, I had done an update that said it appears that C Ivana 2 channel has allowed my comment and warning about Jonathan after all. See her video entitled Macy's Thanksgiving Parade 2015 Satanic Nuclear Bomb NYC Float Subliminal uh, if interested. It gives a link um, <clears throat> in which I give uh, I just go on to say here that Jonathan's ability to see some things is indeed truly amazing, but there's a dark side to Jonathan. He actually believes that Eve had sex with Satan, and we are all the offspring of same. He also believes we are fallen angels in human bodies. I kid you not. And uh, that Cain was the child of Satan and Eve. Be very careful as he refuses to see the truth, and he will ban you. For sharing same. Um, my comment <clears throat> had appeared on her channel and then it didn't appear and then now it's back but it's uh, only back under Firefox but it's not back on Google, which is mind-blowing. I mean, how can this be? How can, how can it be showing up on one and not the other? So, and here it is here. I mean, look, I'll refresh. Um, you know, I had given her kudos and credit for allowing the comment, uh, you know, an opposing point of view on this issue. And then now, it's not here. So, I'm totally confused as far as how these comments can do this. How can it show up on one browser and not the other? Um, but there's something I wanted to go over with you real quick. Um, on, uh, on this deal. So, there's... Uh, A guy here that exemplifies Jonathan's teaching uh, named Greg Ricker. And it says, people can believe the whole world is falling and billions of people are going to hell because one lady ate an apple or you can believe genetically were messed up. So he left something out there. I guess he's assuming, he's say, trying to say we are genetically messed up. Then he says, pay attention, let the Dead Sea Scrolls tell you. And then he quotes, allegedly, from the Dead Sea Scrolls. And Adam knew his wife Eve, who was pregnant by Samuel, Satan, uh, and she conceived in bare Cain, and he was like the heavenly beings and not like earthly beings. And she said, I have gotten a man from the angel of the Lord. Then he says, the Holy Spirit will lead you in what to think. All right. So I just want to point out really quick that this is total fiction. And, uh, you know, the, the Dead Sea Scrolls says no such thing. It's a lie. And um, this is from Mike Heiser's uh, website. And um, he says, this is your antidote for cyber twiddle uh, or twaddle and misguided research about the ancient world. And uh, in his article, was Cain fathered by the devil? No, wait, extraterrestrials. And he explains that he gets more uh, emails on this that he can shake a stick at. And um, he says it usually goes uh, something like this. 
And um, he says, uh, basically, it's hogwash. Okay, right here. It's just hogwash. And then he goes down on down to say that Genesis 4 1 isn't even in the Dead Sea Scrolls. And he says, therefore, the Dead Sea Scrolls cannot uh, or, or don't preserve um, this weird view of Cain's lineage. Now, <clears throat> Going back to uh, to this point that I was trying to make really quick, notice that you know Jonathan didn't correct this teaching. All right, there's no comment here. Nobody corrected this teaching, even though I've been saying it over and over and over again to the point that I got banned that it's false teaching. Um, so I'm going. I'm, you know, what's going on with the church? Why are you guys asleep? Why don't you guys care? Why aren't you guys sharing the truth? I'm like totally blown away that, you know, there's so many people being led astray here. And even the people that are awake aren't doing anything to expose the lie. So, you know, note, I'm not saying everything that Jonathan says is a lie because some of his stuff looks really accurate and true. But, when it comes to this serpent seed doctrine, it's a lie of the devil. I mean, when it said that Adam knew his wife Eve and she had, and she conceived and bare Cain, how much more clear can it get? And they use the same verbiage when uh, talking about Cain knowing his wife and she bare e Enoch. <clears throat> so, and I've already explained to you in my other videos that uh, beguiled does not exclusively mean seduced. So, you know, why aren't the videos being shared? Why aren't you guys getting the word out? Why don't you care? What, I, I don't get it. So, you know, please, somebody please enlighten me as to if you call yourself a Christian believer, how you can sit on your ass and just do nothing and let all this false teaching, you know, be spread all over the place. So... I'd like I'd like some answers on that, okay? Please, uh, you know, can somebody enlighten me as to how you can feel good about yourself, how you can let the world just go right down the toilet with false teaching, and you guys don't lift a finger to do anything about it? Please share, you know, give me an answer. I'd like to know, okay? Thanks. Have a good day.